Love to welcome everybody back to the Independent Investor Channel for our continued coverage of Aduro Clean Technologies. Um, before we get started here, um, I'd like to update you guys on what you need to know for anybody following this story. The ticker symbol has changed. Uh, it is not reflected on their website yet, nor their investor presentation. So there's a lot of literature out there with the old ticker symbol, which is ACTHF. The old ticker symbol it has ceased to exist. It does not exist anymore, my friends. Right now, a duro is being offered uh, on a temporary ticker symbol, and that ticker symbol is ACTHD. Okay, if you held your shares through the reverse stock split that has already become effective in each of your accounts, I'm going to share with you the impact to my share count with you guys in full transparency, um, both verbally on this video, as well as in the description below. I promised that to you, and I'm going to come through with that promise in uh, showing you where we settled out. It's going to relate to this video a little bit in um, conveying to you guys what to expect, at least over the short to near term, uh, as well as what to expect coming into the year's end for Aduro Clean Technologies. Okay, so welcome back to the message. Um, for you guys that uh, are new to the message here, um, please understand um, I am uh, affiliated with Aduro Clean Technologies. I provide these uh, awareness pieces uh, through YouTube as a paid um, consultant with Aduro uh, Clean Technologies. Uh, those disclaimers and my levels of compensation are actually made um, for you in the description below. Um, you can review those at your at your leisure. Uh, and I am compelled to um, remind each and every investor out there to do their own due diligence when making their investment decisions uh, and what is what right for them and their portfolio. Um, I convey my Aduro story uh, over the last going on two, two and a half years now from a bullish perspective. I have been and always will be bullish on this perspective as long as they continue to give me uh, give me reason to be uh, hopeful of the future and what Aduro brings to the table. But I just wanted to make that note at the top of the video here that the ticker symbol has changed. Please make note of that if you do not own shares and you're interested in accumulating shares. It, we're in a very, very interesting time now where certain brokers are restricting um, the purchase of the new shares during this um, during this transition period from the old exchange, OTCQX, to the new exchange, which will be the New York Stock Exchange. And during that time, um, I have actually just successfully bought a few additional shares of ACTHD in my broker, which is uh, Fidelity and Interactive Brokers. Okay? So... If if you're not interested in accumulating new shares, just please understand that if you're going to accumulate shares on an existing position, the new ticker symbol is ACTHD, okay? You will no longer be able to buy the shares under the old ticker symbol. Just a bit of housekeeping at the top of this video to make sure everybody is abreast of that current change. What is the current status of Aduro Clean Technology? Right now, we are in a holding pattern. The F1 has been submitted with the SEC. Um, I have reviewed the F1 filing, and I would encourage you to go to the SEC.gov and review it for yourself. Um, I'm a bullish share owner. You guys know that I have actually been to the property and actually seen um, at least R2 from a, 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 a smaller reactor perspective and got to actually speak with the chief scientist um, and, and, and really was able to understand the excitement around this, this project. Um, and you also need to understand that at present, the current stock is in somewhat of a holding pattern while the F1 filing is being reviewed, and it is undetermined when we can expect any type of announcement of an up uplisting. Um, I would ask you for patience in understanding that this could take upwards of a couple of months. So what does that mean in the interim? Okay. We had a little scare this week in the in the stock. 
Um, a lot of you guys probably noticed a significant downturn in the stock. Um, that was not fundamentally based whatsoever. Uh, I have my presumptions as to what caused it. Um, I will not convey those premonitions with you on a social media outlet. I will not do that. What, what I will say is that uh, contrary to uh, those targeted and, and very direct attacks on the company, um, I held true. And by the end of the same day, uh, had recovered, if not most of, still into the day down a touch, but recovered most of what was um, pretty isolated. Uh, during the course of a very acute time frame um, down to the minute um, on, on what appeared to be an exacerbated sell-off or an attempt to shake people from their shares. And I speak like this because I absolutely do believe that that's what happened. Um, and, and to encourage share owners to be wary of that, please understand that my voice of reason when it comes to not only Aduro Clean Technologies, but my fundamental belief in we invest in a company, not the stock. We invest in the stock long term. We absolutely do not invest in the company from day to day. And especially in this case, what transpired over the course of just a few minutes, um, the sell-off was aggressive. Uh, it was rampant. And it was very obvious to me what was going on. I tried to pick a bottom because while Aduro stock remains static, um, I won't buy the shares, but I did buy that day. Um, I was able to enter into the stock at the the sell-off price of just shy of three dollars uh, and, and and ninety cents. It was about it was a little shy, shy than four dollars. So we went from closer to five all the way below four dollars, and I was able to pick up some shares at about the three ninety mark. Um, and I was happy to do so, no problem. Um, because it was very, very obvious to me what was going on. I don't expect that to be obvious for the masses out there who have came into social media and have been introduced to this opportunity um, and, and, and find themselves in a situation where they're monitoring the stock only to see it digress pretty heavily, okay? I'm not going to sit here and tell you that's normal. That really doesn't explain the situation. What I will say is this. In this transition period from now until this eventual uplisting, I would expect you guys to understand and refocus on why it is you own this company. Okay, We are still trading on a less than adequate exchange. I expect that the visibility will increase. I expect that the volume will significantly increase. And I expect that the awareness overall to the stock and availability to the stock will absolutely be unlocked when this uplisting is final. But we are not there yet. Okay, And we're just going to have to weather this calm before the storm in the interim, and we're going to have to weather short attacks because here's the thing. I see the stock go down like that. I'm going to buy every single time. It goes with my bullish conviction. It goes with my thesis of the company that we are sitting on an opportunity of a lifetime. And here's the thing, guys. The status of Aduro has many, many pockets of pending activity within the company. Okay, We have the next gener generation phase going on right now. We've just announced not only with the uplisting, but a new collaborative phase with Total Energy. We still have the Game Changer program that by all intents and purposes is still progressing, albeit a little slower maybe than what some in, uh, of the share owners out there uh, are comfortable with. Um, I am not one of those. They can take as long as they want with a $250 billion company. I'm okay with it. Uh, and finally, their in, um, their interaction with uh, with with Switch at this point to uh, was in collaboration to scale up a commercial reactor with Switch, uh, along with their other collaborative partners. They have a lot of pockets of progress that are going on at present, and at any time, we can announce progress being made on any of these initiatives that Aduro has with their current partnerships in the industry. And I'm in it. I don't expect that to happen next week, but if it happens, I'm okay with it. Um, when the uplisting happens, I do not know when it'll happen, but I know that it is inevitable. And when that happens, then we will take that in stride 
uh, as a means to an end to a better day. That's for sure. So remember why you're investing in the company. Be very mindful of this technology and how rare it is and how novel it is in uh, approaching the plastic problem uh, with these engagement uh, clients that they're engaging with to try to see how Aduro can fit in their business operations. And I'm in it for the long haul, guys. I wanted to go ahead and convey to you guys my current share position. Again, this will be in the description below. Um, this is post-split, obviously. Uh, the share consolidation went down to 41,882 shares. That's on the dot, my friends. That's where we sit on the Independent Investor Channel. And I just want to remind you of this. When we first started covering this company, right, wrong, or indifferent, we were trading at $0.52 cents U.S., $0.52. Two cents. If you're going to succumb to short term action in the company, I have no business conveying this message to you. Okay. If you want to share in this opportunity the way that I have, I encourage you to do your homework, but it is going to take some fortitude to weather short injects and flash crashes like the likes of what we had this week. We are going to have ups and we are going to have downs. That, my friends, is inevitable. And that I can promise you, if it is too much for you to incur the swings, perhaps maybe you need to reevaluate the game that you are willing to play in stock market investing. And this is speculative at its very, very best. With that said, we have tried to convey in every angle our bullish thesis on this company and chalk it up as to be one of the greatest opportunities that I think I've ever seen in the stock market with what they're doing and what they have going on in a number of different uh, collaborative partnerships across the industry. Guys, it's a very, very exciting time. We just ask for your continued patience and understand and go ahead and discipline, put some of that temperance uh, to, to work and, and risk tolerance to work. My friends, you're going to need it. I appreciate you tuning in to this update on Aduro Clean Technologies. Subscribe to the channel, leave your comments at the bottom of the video, and good luck in your investment future.